Greetings, travelers, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Blind Nuzlocke Pokemon Shield version presented by Draco Breach. Last time, we made it to the uh, Stowen side. Um, actually, I'm going to go ahead and uh, check Pokejobs because I have some Pokemon out and about. Building a solid car. See how effective this is. I think I'm going to, like I said, I think I'm pretty sure I'm going up against um, a fairy gym. Oh, okay. So the Pokemon that were most suited for the job. Um, did the best. What am I doing? It's easier to just do it from here. Hopefully there's not going to be any speed up slowdown. I've been noticing that with uh, my capture a little bit recently. So Yumi apparently is going to be a little difficult to raise. Um, at least to um, evolve. So don't know what's going to happen there. Uh, regardless, um, Ghost and Dark are not very good for a whatever this potential gym is. Um... Right, it might actually be a good idea to... I want to see how well Eric the Red would do. Um, without too much leveling. But it probably would be a good idea to actually level Eric the Red up. Um, it would also be a good... Actually, that's a pot potentially good idea keep bugs in the party I want actually yeah okay so swap out not planning on using Amalga just yet but getting levels is not a bad idea getting levels is definitely not a bad idea Eric the I have to be careful about the mods in this area because I don't think I have a very good team selection for them. Lenape actually probably want to keep in my party because of various reasons. I think because I think the like the Doug trio ground is going to be super effective against Eric the Red. Ground is also super... Is it? Yes. Yes, it is. Lenape can... Mm. I'm going to have to look at the levels of Mons. Um, I don't think there's anything else to do around town besides this... Um, um, where is your mouth? I want to hear bronze. On, I want to he wear bronze on my head. Oh, I did not mean to talk to you. Um, oh, I are. You, oh, they say the same thing. Okay. Come on, let's play with bronze on. I think I have used bronze on in a playthrough. I can't remember. I'm buying. Sure. That guy's going to be rather profitable. Cracked pot? Sure? I 100% know who that's for. They, they, they could not make this evolutionary item any more obvious if they tried. Um, I don't have that Pokemon. I'd like to have that Pokemon because I really like its design. Right, I want to check out what my level up opportunity, what my grind opportunities are down here. Because Eric the Red and Pit, Pit need to catch up. 
um, because they're they will be useful in a fairy gem. I remember Maractus. Helio, Helio, Hel, 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 I don't remember how to say that. Oh, you know, just going straight a Durant. Huh. Surprisingly, I actually have a uh, uh, truant Durant that is uh, stupid fun. Um. I don't really have much for you besides bugs, I'll be honest. Because you're neutral to fighting and quad weak to fire. And that's one of the fun things about, um... I forgot how strong you were, but you're going to be slower than bugs, I'm pretty sure. And you're going to go down in one hit. That would not have been very effective against um, Eric the Red, I don't think. Oh, okay, cool. Oh! Well, it could still be how much uh, he likes me, but uh, fr fr it could still be friendship. I'm not sure. Hello? That's not a Persian. Okay. After many battles, it evolved dangerous claws that come together for to form daggers when extended. Still pure steel type. Iron head. Your speed is not that great. Trying to remember the. I mean, Silk Scarf is still very good for Fake Out. I think I'll get rid of Payday. Worst case scenario, I can make make uh, him relearn it. Okay, so what are your actuals? I I saw them a moment ago, but. Very good, okay. I wish that your nature was better, but eh, beggars can't be choosers. I kind of want to see what Eric the Red can relearn. I'm... It's probably worth it to see what level the gym trainers are. Might be worth it to see that. All right. At the same time, you can't really... That's not what I wanted. Okay. Metal Burst. Um... That's interesting. Iron defense. Growl, hone claws. Scratch payday and swagger. Mm. Swagger could be interesting because of its physical defense. HP is not that great from what I can tell. Taunt will be good. I f Metal Burst is an idea. Why do I... Well, whatever. That's... It's, it's a way to move things around. I 
think I'll go with this team because Wheelie and Bugs resist Fairy. Stack, Eric, and Pit resist Fairy and are, su and are super effective. I, th I think, yeah, I'm pretty sure they do. Uh, Lenape's the only one that's not really like a standout on this particular team. I don't, have, I don't think I have anybody with really standout special defense. Not anybody that I want to put up against them. Okay, your special defense is decent, actually. Especially for, especially considering. Actually, your special defense is pretty... Especially for that level. Yeah, you're going to be... Hmm. Sucker Punch, Metal Claw, Mud Shot... You could be you could be interesting. Actually, you might lead off against um, the ace. Especially, wow, you're, yeah, you're, you're quite good. So, okay, hey, I, I have two physical defense powerhouses. You're actually pretty well off with your special defense. That's pretty good. Uh, you're okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's let's see here. You are not going to talk to me. Uh, what is this is telling me? Balloon Leia. Okay, that's this over here. Some Pokemon live in the mountains. Some Pokemon live in the forests. So many different species. Um, wait, I can go up here. Okay then. Ah, uh, this is an opportunity. Okay, I know something that can be caught here. Um, but looks. Oh nope, I can't. Oh, I'm not allowed in here right now. Cause you guys are going to flat out just block, right? You can't drown us out, mate. Yep. You just blew your horn. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I can't catch anything in here yet. But I do know of something that can be caught in there, thanks to the uh, Pokemon. 24 hour thing that they did that I'm still laughing at that oh my goodness um um hello I want to show the stow on side ruins to my diglet who knows maybe it'll awaken some latent artistic talent right interesting Places where you can Dynamax your Pokemon are known as power spots. The gym uh, stadiums of Galar of the Galar region are built on those power spots. I'm actually reminded of uh, Claydol. Huh. I don't think there's a... <laughs> there might be. I haven't seen all the Galar versions. The ocean, huh? Not a mountain, huh? Okay, so Glimwood Tangle is the next spot I'm going. What is... That looks like a crack in the center of it. Well... Hopefully I'm prepared. Um, Eric the Red and Pit, I think should be fine. Their stats are actually pretty decent, especially when compared to the rest of the team. The only issue is... Oh my goodness. That was a bad joke and you know it. One thing I'm wondering is, um, since it doesn't appear that you can actually change your Gym Challenger clothes, I'm wondering if maybe the DLC will... will add that or if they'll do something uh, but you and your Pokemon have been hanging in there saw me on the telly okay uh, be sure to win I can leave it will reset the gym challenge Eric the Red is very close to level 30, and the evolution is definitely going to help him. 
Pit doesn't evolve. Okay. Actually, I don't know that for certain. They could have changed that. They could have added an evolution. Eep, a gym challenger. Are you here to challenge the gym? I am. Okay, in that case, please change the new uniform. Yes, the changing room is uh, right over there. He seems nervous for some reason. Maybe I should run away. Maybe he's telling me that I'm not ready. Number 023, do your best. Wait, is this ghost? So this is not, um, what's her name? Allow me to explain the gym mission for Stow, and Stow on Size Gym. To complete the mission, you need to ride on one of these cups and make it all the way to the goal um, while trying to avoid obstacles. Uh, let me tell you a bit more about how to operate this fun attraction. Rotate your control stick to the right and then and the cup will start to spin to the right. Rotate to the left and make to, uh, to make the cup spin left. If you hit a wall, rotate the stick as quickly as you can to get yourself out of that sticky situation. Now have a good time watching the world spin as you reach the, your goal. If this is Ghost... Oh, I am not going to... Okay. I think this might be Ghost. I can't change Pokemon. Who's my best bet against Ghost types? I don't really have anybody. If it is Ghost, I might be in slight trouble. Okay, Lenape can handle them. Assurance, that does damage. Okay, just in case. If this is if this is Ghost, I am retreating. <laughs> Because, based on the fact that it's tea cups, and I know a particular mon in here that is tea, literally. Yep, it's ghost time. Okay, you're ghost grass. So I can actually use my stronger um, sludge bomb to take you out. Bolt seed I'm going to resist. I'm surprised at how little that did. Trick or treat. I think that's a ghost move. I'm not gonna re What? Ghost type added to the stack, so I'm I'm Ooh, that can be dangerous. Because that makes you weak to dark. And a lot of ghost types know dark type moves. Phantom. I Oh, yeah, you're grass type. That was a. That's a, actually a bad move. Um. But that gets rid of. Ghost type. So, benefits. It works. I. Right, they're grass type, so I can easily send out, um. Um either one of my fire types to deal with them. Uh, okay, Sludge Bomb again. You know... I'm 
I'm faster, and this does more than 50% of your health and damage, so... I'm glad Phantom is actually kind of slow. Ah, uh, bugs, come on out. This is going to be an interesting gym. I could go back for Umpire. That might be a good idea. The umpire is going to have the advantage of being immune to their ghost type attacks and dealing spectacular damage with its ghost type, dark type attacks. I think I'll do that. Cause that's my, that's probably my best ad advantage. Um, Really, it can't use either uh, any of its other moves. I hate resetting it this early, but at the same time, I kind of... I lost. My consciousness has been sent flying. I kind of need... Oh, hello. You evolved at... What was that, 34? I was expecting 36, I'll be honest. Okay. That pose, though. That pose, though. Still pure fire. It's skilled at both offense and defense, and it gets pumped when cheer uh, when cheered on. But if it starts uh, showboating, it could put itself in a tough spot. Oh, yeah, that, that that's generally true. Pyro ball. What does pyro ball do? Hi. The user attacks by igniting small stone and launching. This has no drawbacks, except for the somewhat l No, I don't need flame charge, honestly. That accuracy could be dangerous, but... Um, yeah, I'm gonna go get... I am 100% getting um, umpire. Yeah, I don't, I don't care. I'm getting Umpire because this is a Ghost Gym. And Umpire will be 100% useful. Um, Lenape's Dark Move could be useful. I think I'm, it's gonna be, I think, uh, Ooh, um, actually I have two dark types, don't I? Your speed is good, you're more of a special attacker, and you have Snarl. Okay. Think I think that's what we're going with. We're gonna lead with umpire. So when do I we fight the um fairy gym? That's gonna be good to learn. Alright. So if we're doing that. Okay, so leading with umpire will make us immune to ghost type attacks. So we're taking out some of their strongest attacks and we can do some swap predictions to swap into potentially potentially swap into a ghost type attack and um eliminate uh, eliminate strong attacks. That'll be especially effective against... Oh, ooh, that'll be very effective against um, 
the Dynamax, especially if they decide to lead with a ghost type attack, we could swap in, make their first attack completely useless, and basically remove one of their three turns as a Dynamax. Okay, so you do not challenge us again. That's good to know. Oh. Um. Got through that part was actually easier than the first part. Okay. Yeah. Back and forth, back and forth. You're spinning back and forth, back and forth. Me too. Okay then. Hello. used to be rock water. I guess you're ground rock or ground water now. Um, I should be faster. So let's go ahead and start with Night Slash. I need to pay attention to levels. 32. Okay. Mm. Oh, that's both good and bad. Oh, disable. Uh, can't use Night Slash. I'm going to take a wild guess that you don't really have anything to combat the nape. Because. Ghost is not super effective. Rock is not super effective either. And I have physical defense to back me up there. So try crunch. Fortunately, your defense was decreased, so yeah, you're pretty much an easy. Easy KO from there. Losing made me remember the gym leader wears a mask. Yep, it's exactly who I think it is. Okay. Okay. Um, level 32 with a single Pokemon. Which is making me think that the Ace will be level 33 or 34. Okay, so I went the wrong way. I need to go to the right. Okay, that was neat. Can you understand what ghost type Pokemon are weak to? I don't think so. Ghost types are weak to dark. They're also weak to ghost, which is hilarious. Oh, and you're also weak to psychic. And... Hmm, what else? Payback moving first. Uh, and it, I'm... I'm resistant to it, so I don't care. Wait, you're 33. Okay, I am getting a little bit more worried about the leader. Drift limb. It could have... It 
could have um I cannot remember what the what it's called. The the, the thing that damages you if it aftermath, I believe. Critical and it didn't take and it didn't go down. Wow. But that's Driftblim for you. It is a tank. Okay. Aftermath is not going to take me out from near full health. Okay, this is actually looking good for me. If you understand type matchups, it's only natural that it'd be easier to win. The thing is, I don't know what type um, Poltegeist is. I have guesses, but that's about it. I think I'm actually fairly well prepared. I didn't take much damage. Only issue is... I have Super Potion. Okay. I think I'm pretty well off. I haven't gotten this guy's... Um, trainer card. So... I, I can't... Is it Alistair? Mm, Alistair. Yeah, it is. Here I go. I don't know if that voice matches him or not. Okay, I need to try... Yeah, Mask. Okay, so Ground Ghost. You're weak to Water, Dark. You're super effective against Fire. Your ground type moves could be oh whatever I don't I don't care. Wait, you switch abilities? Brutal swing is normal. No, it's dark. Interesting. So making physical contact swaps abilities, and if the ability is useless. Like pickup, it doesn't really matter. I didn't actually check to see if uh, Umpire was holding anything. Okay, Sly got a level up, so that could be. Ooh. Ooh. Um. Honestly, you're not much of a phys physical attacker. Let's get rid of Home Claws for that. Mimic you. You're a fairy type, that's a problem. And you can survive the first attack. You're slow, but have a lot of physical attack. I don't think you have anything that's going to be super effective against stack. So we'll start with will o -Wisp to cut your attack in half. Okay, never mind, you are faster than the stack. That's fine. But now, you are literally half as effective. Okay, so let's start with... something weak, Assurance. You're gonna resist it. which is fine by me. And Disguise is broken. Wait, what? Why did you take damage? You shouldn't have taken damage. That's weird. Stack is going to be vital. <laughs> Ha! 
Ghost Fairy, you should be weak to, um, Sludge Bomb. Did I just miss a dialogue box or something? Something weak. I'm trying to think of I'm trying to think about what could come out next. So we've seen something powerful in Hello? So, Corsola evolves. Interesting. Start off by cutting your attack in half, although that might not mean anything to you. I don't know. Hex. Uh, what does that do? Excuse me? You've got to be kidding me. Is your defense lower than... Because you're higher level and you took more damage. Ouch! Your speed... Umpire, you please be faster. I cannot afford to switch right now. Okay, good. Good. Come on, I wanted a Galarian Weezing. Ugh. How did... How did Stack get pretty much one shot there? Um, I don't want Scary Face. Gengar. You are a special attacker. Um... You probably have my best. You have very high, but you don't have anything that's. Sucker Punch and Snarl. Sucker Punch and Snarl. Go ahead and swap you out. Heal up Umpire. My very last Pokemon. How lonely. How frightening. Thing is, I'm pretty sure Sly resists anything. Oh boy, that level difference. Um, I am 100% using this on Umpire. And then I'll get started on... on um, Gigantic. Okay, that's. So you're not just Dynamaxing, you're Gigantamaxing. Yay, this is gonna be fun. It's an amusement park! Seriously, it looks like that one um, attraction in. Uh... G Max Terror. It's like Shadow Tag, you won't get away. I won't let you. Wait. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Huh? 
didn't resist that, I don't think, so... Max, ooh, so a poison type move. Oh, and raising its special attack. This is wonderful. Yeah, I'm I'm baiting out the rest of his um I uh, um max turns. Oh boy. Problem is I don't I think I still can't escape. Yep, okay. I'd like Sly to at least put in some work here. So... Venno Shock, it works better if I'm all... Okay. Not getting out of this, so sucker punch and take as much HP as I can with me. I'm sorry, Sly, but you are not getting out of this alive. Because Finishock would have eventually critted. Oh, you had. Okay. Mm hmm. Okay, so. Problem is, you're actually pretty fast. I am going to trust you, umpire, because I think physical attacks are the way to go. And I think your speed is actually pretty decent. Please do not let my trust be in... You're gone, aren't you? You held on. Please take him out. Oh! Oh! Okay, Alistair, you kind of made me mad. Oh my goodness. I nearly lost my mask from the shock. That was... How can I see your... I, wow, I can see your skill for what it is. Yeah, well... <laughs> Hello? I'll take another... I'll take a free evolution. Kind of look like, um, Rhyperior. Colossal. While it's in, engaged in battle, its mountain of, co uh, mountain of coal will burn bright red, sending off sparks that scorch the surrounding area. Tar shot? I'm interested. I am intrigued. Um. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> the speed lowering is pointless. It really is. Um. I can't think of anything that I want to get rid of, though. I'm going to leave it. I might come back and learn it later, but I'm going to leave it as is. Darn you, Alistair! Crumbs. That was ace. Here, a ghost badge. I've, I've given him, what, three different voices there? I'm not a voice actor. I do not claim to be. Do not pretend to be. Good, good luck with, um, everything. 
You've defeated Leader Alistair. Take this TM. I get to re- because I'm pretty sure this does double damage if the Pokemon has a status ailment. I'm absolutely right. And a complimentary ghost uniform. Unfortunately, we have Pokemon to send to the graveyard. S Bello. Stack. Stack. And Sly. You didn't really get to prove your worth, unfortunately, but you will be missed. Stack. I wish you weren't gone. There are... Okay. Okay. Let's go ahead and get Eric the Red some levels. That is super unfortunate. So that would be Sonia? Looks like my Yamper really likes you, huh? Anyway, we've uh, run into each other at a good time. You know the mural here in Stowe on side? It's, uh, it's said to tell the story of the hero of Galar as well. Though what's there today is actually a replica of the ancient art that used to be there. You tend to have surprisingly sharp insights, so I was wondering what you might think when you see the ruins. That's not good. What what in the world was that? Sounds like it came from the direction of the ruins, too. Let's have a look. Come along, Yamper. What is my condition? Healthy. Oh, you know what would be a good idea? First of all... You didn't have a held item. Yeah, we're fine there. Do you have anything to say? What's going on? I heard a huge noise come from the, from the direction of the mural. Is this some sort of surprise event for tourists? I very much doubt it. It's probably kind of like the galactic bomb. What's going on up there? What's going on? What's happened at the ruins? I love how they're keeping it out of sight too. I've seen you before. Are you the gym? Are you a gym challenger? What are you doing? Destroy it! Destroy it all! We're going to find those wishing stars. Wash. Yeah, Bead, you're 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 a jerk. We've got to bring the chairman more wishing stars if we want to please him. If you truly are the, uh, if you're truly the chairman's Pokemon, then you should feel grateful for this chance to help him find wishing stars. Oh wait, am I actually ready for this? Because he's taken out a Pokemon before. Oh my, you again. So you think you can start collecting wishing stars now and get in the chairman's favor? That's the way of things, is it? I see. So you do have some cunning in you, but. I won't have it. I won't allow anyone to stand in my way. Well... Okay. We know he likes his psychic types. Steel resists psychic. Start with a fake out. Free, free, it's a free attack. Hm, I've already seen more than enough to judge you and your team's abilities. Yeah, except, um... Okay, Duosion is pretty slow, but it might be faster than, per, uh, than... Try Iron Head. 
I'm faster, which means I have a chance to flinch. Okay, good. So finish that off with... Never mind. What does Metal Claw... Metal Claw does a decent chunk of damage. I'm going to do it again and hope for a attack increase. Did not get an attack increase, that's fine. But this time, I am not going to make the dumb mistake. Hat... Hatrem. Um, umpire, come on out. Because you are immune to psychic attacks. And Hatrem, I believe, is pure psychic. If it's... I'm sorry, that looks like a fairy type. But I'm doing super effective damage, so it can't... Hello? I'm faster, so goodbye. It evolves into a fairy type, 100% guaranteed it evolves into a fairy type. Which means I cannot rely on umpire in the future against it. Ponita is a... No, pure psychic. So, we're going to heal up just in case you have a dangerous move. Watch you have Dazzling Gleam. Excuse me! Excuse me! That was super effective, barely did any damage. Eric the Red resists... Steel type resists both fairy and psychic. You're going to use agility. I'm going to use fake out. Okay, so your physical defense is not that great. You're going to be faster than me. Use psi beam, which is not going to. Oh, critical. What is up with Bead wanting to kill my... Okay, you're probably going to use a potion. I can't predict Bead, apparently. So what's your last mon going to be? Are you going to surprise me with something else that just screams, I'm um, psychic, but I have fairy moves. Gothrita, I don't... Oh, Gothrita. Is special. You know, let's get introduced to Pyro Ball. Because your special defense is actually pretty high. And I can always swap you out for, um... I have to win this for the chairman. Do you really think I'd let you keep me from anything I want? From everything I want? Honestly, you're not even fully evolved, so this might be overkill. But, I don't care. Psy Beam, and... Does about as much as a crit against... There we go. As... as a as the last Pokemon did with a crit to Eric the Red. So there's that. This has to be some kind of mistake. I demand a do-over. Oh, trust me, I'm not giving you a do-over. But why? How can this be? How could someone like you get in my way? I was the one chosen by the chairman. I was the one who defeated the cha who who was to defeat the champion. I thought he said he defeated him already. 
I'm one of the elites, someone who can shoulder the future of the Galar region. Challenger Bead. I wondered what you were up to when you asked to borrow Chairman Rose's Caparaja. Can't believe you'd try to use the Chairman's Pokemon to destroy a historic site. Who cares for some ancient ruin when the next thousand years are at stake? Did you stand in the path of Pokemon's... Uh, you, did you stand in the path of a Pokemon simple, simple beam or something? I, is that what you, is that? Does that change your um, ability to simple? I, I think that's what it is. How do you expect to support the chairman with that sort of thinking? Young Bead. It pains me to have to say this, but I am truly disappointed. It's true that I am the one who the one who found you back when you were all alone. I saw talent in you. You reminded me a, a little bit of myself back when you went back, da, 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 back when I was young. That's why I sent you to the trainers to his trainer school to give you a chance to, uh, of I cannot read at success. But trying to destroy the mural, part of Galar's history, you show no love towards Galar. You are clearly not worthy a worthy challenger for the gym challenge. We will decide what to do with you later. For now, you will return to Hammerlock. I guess they preemptively put that crack on it. You, you must be joking, right? You're disqualifying me from the gym challenge? But you're the one who endorsed me. There are a hundred different ways we could sort this out. Why are you choosing the worst possible option? Challenger Bead, I will be taking those wishing stars that you have gathered. Well, that's a character arc. Ah, Sonia, and Gabriel too. Terrible shame, all this. An absolute disaster. I never wish to see us lose challengers for this sort of reason. Yet, we do what we must do to keep things fair and sportsmanlike. You know, during one of Bede's matches, I heard the announcer say that Bede has no family. Apparently it was Rose who took Bede under his wing, so and so Bede was battling for the chairman's sake. What an awful turn of events. I hope the I hope the mural survived all that. I mean, it looks like it did. I mean, there's that crack, but... Oh, never mind. I spoke way too soon. Oh, look. It's a shield. I wonder what that could be. Oh, and a shield. I said shield already. And a sword. I, I love the, the the thinking Sonya there, just like putting two and two together. And then the click. Not a brilliant turn of events, but the ruins are uh, were brought into light for us to see. What does this tell us about Galar's legends? Right, more than any hero... There's those things that appear to be Pokemon that stand out. Not just that, but those Pokemon appear to be holding a sword and a shield as if they were using them. Anything else look interesting to you? Oh, good observation. There really were two heroes, but if that's the case, then only one uh, then then why only the one statue at the Badoo drop in? More than any statue of a hero or old tapestry, these ruins made it. Uh, these ruins made in truly ancient times must show us the real truth, which means. Uh, sure, yep, I was thinking the same thing. Seems like at some point in history, the sword and shield were combined with two, uh, with the two actual Pokemon and treated as the same thing, but then, uh, but then what? They just faded from history. Two young heroes, the sword and the shield, were actually Pokemon. But why would the truth of these ruins be hidden when their stories were depicted uh, in artwork? With your help, I really feel like we made a big discovery here. Thanks, I'll give you a couple of these so you can keep giving it your best in the gym challenge too, okay? Guess you'll be heading to Balanleia? Ba okay, next, right? More revives. Sonia! <laughs> Sonia! I lost two Pokemon. Please don't remind me. Oh. 
Yeah, that that's that, that's just that's just sad. But what is this? The hero is actually two people and a po and Pokemon. I feel it was more artistic before it got destroyed. <laughs> that young lady, Sonia, she's researching the truth about the ruins, right? Could she be the granddaughter of Professor Magnolia? I'm pretty sure everybody's safe. Yeah, okay. Didn't really take too much damage in that battle against Bead. Thankful compared to what happened last time. Goodbye, 409. But, uh... I, I, that cinematic with Sonya putting two and two together, it could not have been better, honestly. Did I go up here? No, I did not. Crack. I got a free cracked pot. I didn't need to buy one. Oh well, at the same time, since it is an evolutionary item, um, that's going to be rather important. Okay. Why did you have to pick up one of those? Umpire, I can't revive them. They are gone. They are gone from this challenge. Okay, 65 power coming from a Gengar is actually dangerous. Okay, so false swipe can be learned by Lin Nape. I mean, I can use the, the move relearner. I'll get rid of protect. I can always come back and learn re and relearn protect, so that's not an issue. But that gives me an easy way. Actually, actually. Mm, I don't have. It's probably better. For catching to reduce HP. Okay, this is going to be interesting, probably. Try to avoid the multitude of problems that can arise here. Yeah, you guys... Oh! Okay, I'm getting a legal impidimp. And you are male. You're actually pretty high level. Assurance. It's not gonna do much. Sucker Punch, that could do not nearly as much as I thought. Okay, so now you have one HP. They're not in order. Sure, because <laughs> so much, so much of my team had, was in, was originally caught in heel balls. So, so you are the true Loki. The other Loki was an imposter, a fake. Okay, and like I said, um, I will be catching a.
Ponida for some, for a friend. So, oh, okay. Another impotent. Oh, hello. Are you looking for mushrooms? They give off light when you touch them. This might be a pretty decent place to um, raise steel and poison types based on case in point. So I'm going to put um, Eric the Red up front. Genotic. Are you part grass? I don't remember. And just in case. You're more of a defensive type anyway. So Iron Head. Are you going to use a healing item? No, you are not. So I have a chance for an attack increase and did not get it, okay. Sinistia. Wait, is that Ghost Fairy? That would be interesting. Yeah, like as soon as I saw the saw its name, I was pretty sure of what it was. I missed. Because it's its name, I mean, it has T in it. Hey, a strong trainer, that's rarer than rare mushrooms. It said uh, that there's some rare mushrooms in Glimwood Tangle. I'm hoping to make some good curry if I find any. I might want to look up recipes for make, making my own curry sometime. Bright powder. That could actually... I'm wondering which uh, which is more potent, lax incense or bright powder. So I don't know if there's actually all that much difference. From what I can tell, pushing those mushrooms will probably make a... Oh, I want one of you. Yeah, I said effective. Okay. The people, the uh, Pokemon using Sucker Punch in here, I tell you. Okay, actually gonna swap Lenape and not Umpire. Well, a free um, doll is going to be useful. Eric the Red should be fine on hit points, especially if most of the Pokemon in here are um, fairy types. Ooh, Big Root. Nice. Can you... No, that's not a bridge. Okay. Ooh, hello. Snore. That could be useful. Umpire might be able to use that. Oh, double battle. The railways are amazing. They can carry lots of people and Pokemon at once. I came to ride the Galar train. I, I wonder if meeting you will change my life. Okay, Psychic Fairy and 
Tough Claws is not going to help you. Go ahead and do that there, and that there. And see? I actually forgot that Ninetales was Fire-type after I said that it was Fire-type. Okay. Kirala should not know anything super powerful at this point. Drill pack. Yes, please. Disarming voice hits both, so that's not going to be a big deal. Rock Tomb. Well, I was right. Resistance plus spread damage. If that had been one-on-one, -on -one, that might have done some serious damage to Eric the Red. No. A good way to forget the trouble of this loss would be to ride the train. Too strong. Guess I'll look for someone I can actually beat. Okay. Hyper potions. I'll take free hyper. Um, hello. Some mushrooms react in interesting ways when you touch them. Okay, Judy, what do you have? In DD. Hello. Um, don't know what you are, but you're probably psychic or fairy. Psychic. And you're very weak to physical attacks. Or maybe you're both? Huh. That's an interesting Pokemon. It kind of looks like, um, what was it, Esper? You're sending out another one? Play nice. What? The, that reduces attack? Yep, it reduces attack. Not enough. Psybeam critical could hurt, but it was not a critical. And I resisted, so... Mad Madams like me react in sad ways when we're defeated. You're kind of giving the <laughs> look there. Oh boy. Snore could be interesting. It honestly could be. Hopefully Eric the Red's stats prove to be very useful. <laughs> Wait, is that a static encounter? I, I'm, I, you look like an evol evolution of Impidimp. Um, I don't think you. Oh, Torment. Duh. Oh, that looked dangerous. What was that?
Oh, regardless. Victory is mine. I don't... That was odd, though. Oh, uh... Interesting. Reduces power of water type moves, I guess? How is Eric the Red's fine, I think? There we go. Back in order. You turn. Um, yes, please. Um, you know what? I'm going to get rid of Headbutt for that. Yes, yes, you are seeing me do this. This is absolutely an amazing move. I'm, mm, yeah, I'm going to get rid of Taunt. For you, I will get rid of Taunt for you turn. Um, I don't think Eric the Red is very good support anyway. Um, okay, now look at Lancelot, see if there's anything. No, not, don't. Mm. That attract is very situational. Payback. No, it's so fast that it's not really going to be able to... I don't want Retaliate to ever be super effective. Oh, I, I'm probably going to have to wait on Lancelot or learning anything new then. Can't jump down here. No, I can't. Okay, good. I haven't seen any Ponitas, but with you turn, hmm, you guys can learn Will-O-Wisp. So you turn. I love. I'm sorry. I I love being able to do dumb things like that. Um, because you. Can can learn Will-O-Wisp, and you might be at that level. Bugs? Oh, wait. Nope, you're dead. Because that's half your hit points, and Curse does not get placed on Bugs. Gotta love it. Um... With how dark it is, it's kind of weird. Oh, I guess that's it for Glim Glimwood. I am going to go back in there um, and look for a Ponita, of course. That will have to be recorded, of course, because I'm not leaving anything unrecorded. But, oh, this is 100%. Lol, lol. This is 100% uh, the fair... Why are those there. So it'd probably be a good idea to raise pits. Actually, I haven't checked something. You two evolved, so check to see what you know. Faint, Tackle, Ember, Quick Attack, Flame, Charge, Agility, and Headbutts. Nothing too terribly interesting. In fact, I don't think there's anything new here. Okay, and Wheelia. Tar shot is interesting, it really is. If it did damage, I would 100% get it. 
Nothing. I mean, ancient power is always an idea. I don't think there's anyone. Oh, uh. You don't belong. Oops. Wait. Is prankster interesting? Fake out. The thing is, with prankster, torment and swagger are very good. But I need to move it from the graveyard because apparently I can't keep track of where I send Pokemon. Because you are 100% eligible. Unlike the, the, un unlike the fake in the box. What do you have? Anything? Ooh. I'm gonna buy... And I'll buy eight of you, because you're still actually useful. Repels could be useful, but I'm not terribly interested in them right now. I am actually eligible to go... into the wild area for Dynamax. For, I'm, for a, I'm sorry, for a, a, for a den Pokemon. I can catch up to level 40. The thing is, I do want to, Frank, that might, that's my granddad's name. I'm a, if I'm a Pokemon, have a battle with me. Scorbunny and Sizzlepeed are different species, but they uh, but they're still both Pokemon. Scorbunny and I are different are different species, just like Sizzlepeed and I are different too. If you think about it that way, then uh, there's no problem with me calling me a Pokemon. I don't mind. What? You don't have to uh, you don't have to worry about me. Even I know it's a uh, pretty lofty logic. I I wanted to become a Pokemon once. Well, good luck with that. Hey, I've got it. A ch uh, change of fashion style. Basically, if I can make myself feel um, the way a Pokemon does, it'd uh, be like I became a Pokemon, don't you think? Can I can I leave now? You would you be please would you please put on some clothes with a fiery spirit that embodies my burning feeling? I'm leaving now. Let's see. There's the gym. What else is around here? Well, useful things. Why is there a random, uh... Okay, I can now teach anybody rest. There is not anything else here besides some homes. May as well talk to people and find out what they have to give, if anything. What's this? You got a letter addressed to me. This guy is way older than the girl who... Yeah, this, this is another one of those um, mysteries, like a, a, a ghost, a, a human ghost interacting with the world. Now, who could be sending me letters? Oh, why, this says it's from Paula. That does take me back ages. Paula was the name of a girl I spent all my time playing with when I was a young lad. She fell ill, didn't, uh, didn't tell me, though. She kept it a secret just how sick she was. We ended up having a great row about it. Then I moved away uh, not long after that fight. I never met her again after the day I left. How was she? Did she look well? Dear old Paula. 
dot, 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 dot. She looked well. It's a comfort to hear. I reckon I ought to give you something for this uh, for this gift you've brought. For you've brought me uh, brought me back a piece of my youth. She looked well. Wait, what did... Um, do you have a dear friend in your life? Make sure you treasure those dear to you while you, uh, you have them close. It's a small theater. Opal, Opal's the gym leader. Okay. Hey, don't un interrupt our conversation. There's somebody on the other side of that wall. Um, okay then. Oh, look at you. Defeated the uh, stone on sides gym leader, eh? You'll, you'd probably know uh, your way around a TM like this one in, in that case. Revenge. I don't remember that one. Oh, okay. Having your Pokemon, Pokemon learn moves of different types can really help you, you know? Evolution is a bit tricky for Pokemon trainers. If a Pokemon evolves, it'll get stronger, but its appearance will change. Do you want to know how to make your Pokemon strong without it, without it evolving? Oh, come on. I wasn't expecting a... <laughs> Roshi. I 100% bet that this is... Um... Eviolite. Because that um, increases uh, defense and special defense of a not fully evolved Pokemon that can... Okay, that's actually redundant to say. Of a Pokemon that still has evolutions remaining. That took a while to take out, so I'm... I'm Willing to bet that that was an Eviolite. I didn't expect you to be able to breach Dotler's sol solid sol solidity. I would have been able to do it faster too, with um, Drill Peck or Pyro Ball. Even though my Dotler hasn't evolved yet, it was it was hard to take down, wasn't it? That's the secret to yep, Eviolite. If you let Pokemon that can still evolve hold this Eviolite, that Pokemon's defense and special defense will go up. Very useful for... Um, Pokemon like Chansey, since Chansey with an Eviolite is actually higher defense than um, Blissey. Wonder what other Pokemon it would be useful on. Now that I'm thinking about it, I'm I'm sure there are some, especially when you get into um, <laughs> especially when you get into certain um, oh in case I actually use the Malamar in Ultra Sun Ultra Moon just for fun, but um, wait, is that an item? No. What was I saying? I don't even remember. That's good. Um. Yeah, I think I'm... Wait, what am I doing? Uh, if we're going up against a fairy gym, umpire is a no-go, but pit is a yes-go. Loki is fairy dark, which makes it neutral against fairies. But unfortunately, that's actually kind of bad. But Loki will be useful against Raihan, especially if it learns a fairy type move. Okay, let's see if I can find... 
a Ponyta. Probably gonna be hard, but at the same time, I also... It's probably gonna be hard. First encounter is a Ponyta. Um... You're not gonna go down in one hit. Heal Pulse? Why would you do that? Okay. Um, yeah, Heal Ball. And it's female, which is perfect, because that will make it easier for my friend to breed. If that's all you're going to use, that's fine. Um, what is your coloration? Premier Ball wouldn't look too bad on you. I'm not going to use one of the special balls because I don't have access to apricorns yet, so... I'm resistant to that. And I have high enough defense that I don't care. Yeah, those are apricorn balls, so I'm not using them. Dream Ball and Beast Ball are not. I'm wondering if there's going to be a way to get more of those. I'll throw some more Premier Balls. Because, frankly, it, I think that looks pretty good, coloration-wise. Oh, come on. Oh, and, of course, any of the Pokémon that I've caught that are eligible for me to use on my team, I, I, I bring it up again. Feel free to come up with names for them. I don't mind. I really don't. I'm bad with names anyway, so I'll remember their species before I remember their names sometimes. A critical side beam won't take me out. Come on, I'd like to catch you in a decent looking Pokeball. Please. This isn't even for me, it's for a friend. Please. I still don't think that a critical will take me out, but... Oh, of course, you used my last Premier Ball. Please, please. Hold down B. It wore. It failed. Ah, oh, boy. Okay. Great Ball doesn't look too bad. With the white, blue, and red. Yeah, Great Ball's fine. Ultra Ball honestly doesn't look too bad with the um, yet yeah, the uh, yellow and black. Of course, of course. I wanted you in a Premier Ball. That's fine. Um, think of a decent nickname. What that? I think this is... I'm going to double check because I don't want to... I am spelling it right. Good. Send your box. So, like I said, I am not using this. I am curious though. 
and it has Pestel Veil. Vale. Not a very good nature. But your stats actually seem pretty good, so you might have decent IVs. I am going to get Eric the Red up in some levels. Because I have a feeling I'm kind of be Oh, and Pit. Pit's also behind, so... I actually... Okay, U-turn is effective, which means that it's not part grass type, because I don't... Oh, because of course you did. Yeah, I'd like to get Pit up a few levels. Uh, once I get Eric the Red one more level, I'll I'll start swap training Pit. The grass in here is small. Another more grim. Makes me think that, um, I need to level up, I need swagger because of course, I need to level up, uh, Impidimp. You sealed your own fate. But I can worry about that later. Let's go to the grass that's closer to the entrance. I probably should have just gone in the grass for for Morgrim rather than catch an impidimp. Assurance is not going to do much. It's a pretty weak move, so it doesn't concern me at all. Might actually put... Oh, hello, Spritzy. You evolve into Aromatisse, I believe. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm actually going to swap out... Um, no, I don't want counter. Swap out bugs for Impidimp. For Loki, I should say. Let Loki get some levels. Probably evolve into a Morgrim. Hopefully. Hopefully I'm right that all I need is like one more level. I don't know why I use Metal Claw. But I did. That happened. Oh. That's fine. I'll use another Metal Claw. I'm not going to be able to use another Metal Claw. Wait. I thought that prevented... They must have changed how that works. That's the only explanation I have. Okay, Eric the Red is up to 34, so now we can... Um, Try swap training with Pit. If uh, Lenape gains another level, I have to swap him out just for safety, re for just for reasons of not over leveling too much. Um, Wheelia, two more levels. Lancelot, three more levels, and swap them out. Like I, I want to have some good, healthy levels, but I don't want to have too many.
I'm wondering why I can't see... What is it? Mortal the The stage down? I am going to try Metal Claw. Because Technic... Why did you heal yourself? That's a crit. Oh, boy. Oh. Yay! You, I don't think you can do much to me, though, unless you know a grass move. Grass move could be dangerous. So, yeah, there's that. I mean, technically, Sleep Powder is a grass-type move. And you are continuing to use it. I am glad I have not used, uh... Awakening, that's what it's called. Good, 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 good. Honestly, grinding in here is going to be a bit difficult, isn't it? Orangaroo? You're psychic type. Psychic normal. Wash makes me go last, but it doesn't. It's not an attack move. Oh, Zen headbutt. Ah, uh, physical attack. Zen headbutt again. <laughs> Alright, Zen headbutt again. I'm gonna guess that you're not gonna use Zen Headbutt. Haha! -ha. Okay, Zen Headbutt? Nope. You are incredibly annoying. Like I said, you are incredibly annoying. Especially since technically I can't... Well, I mean, I could have swapped out. But I wanted as much from that as I could get. Stealth rocks. Ooh, um, mm. yes. So lead with Wheelia against Opal. I'm not going to fight Opal this episode, because I'm going to be ending it in 10-ish minutes. Going to look around the wild area right quick. I don't know if you can actually use the town map from uh, to fly from in the... Um, From inside the... Poké Center. My guess is probably no. Okay, there's one. There's no other. Garboder. Or Garbador. I don't know how to pronounce it. 
Actually, I'm kind of surprised that there's only one. I don't know what you are. You look like you could be a... Ma All right. Because I don't know what it is... I'm going to save just in case it is something. Oh, uh, switch Pokemon. Fighting type. Fighting type moves won't do anything. Physical, 60, special. That's going to be resisted, I think. That will... If it has status afflictions. Probably not a good idea. No, you're going to be super weak to it. You're going to be weak to it. You'll resist it. Yeah, let's go with you. Like I said, if this is not eligible, I'm hitting home and, and exiting, basically. Because I can't tell what it was. It's not eligible. I had to leave. And unfortunately, you can't run from dead battles. I couldn't tell what it was. I thought it might have been from the Machoke line. But I think there's a Pokemon that looks very similar. Based on its um, silhouette. That is eligible. So. Alright. Oh, hello Lapras. Okay, there's one right across the bridge. There's none today, there could be some more later. And Snorlax likes to pop up there. You're not eligible. I like you though. Okay, there's two that I can check over here. Three, four, five. Okay, a lot of the dens over here I can check. I have to be careful because there are some overpowered Pokemon in this area. I don't know what you are. I'm going to check the other dens right quick. Ah, uh, yeah, you're not eligible. Should be one... Yep, right here. So let's check you. Wait, Ice Psychic? Mr. Mime is not Ice Psychic. I, uh, I psychic. Okay, if you, what am I doing? Save. Switch. Um, ice psychic. 
Ice is super effective. Okay. How do I want to go about this? Umpire would be immune. And then I would only have to worry about ice type moves. Mr. Mime is a... You resist ice and you're super effective against ice i think i'll go with you yeah i think i'll go with you because your attack is really good mr mime is not ice type so, this has got to be a Galarian form. Yes, that is a Galarian form. Okay, Weevil is going to make it use twice its, uh, twice its power point moves. So, let's go ahead and Dynamax immediately and... Wait, double check. Okay, no, we cannot see. Ah, uh, Psychic is weak to Bug. Okay, so let's start with Max Flare. Because that'll power up Fire-type moves and deal a massive amount of damage. So there, that's good. Oh wow, that pose. It's tap dancing. Okay. Well, that was quick. And we can now throw a Pokeball. This is Jim. This is the one allowance for Jim number four. One of our two allowances has been used up. Um, actually, black and yellow looks pretty good on you, Mr. Mine. Let's hope that your uh, let's, let's hope that you evolve, and if you evolve, it equally looks as good in a Ultra Ball. One, a two, a three, a <laughs> four. Three licks is all it takes to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop. Okay, so... Psy Shock. Ooh, and... Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, then. It can radiate chilliness from the bottoms of its feet. It'll spend the whole day tap dancing on a frozen floor. We have to give you a name. Um... Actually, I. Because that makes... An Ice Psychic, that could be useful against Raihan. Okay, so, once we defeat the 8th Gym Leader... Hello. Uh, that means we can catch one more Den Pokémon. And I think I'm going to go ahead and call it there for today. Where am I? I'm here. So... Next time we'll probably start off with some more grinding to get uh, Pit and Eric a few more levels because they're going to be kind of vital. Loki's going to sit that out because, yeah, neutral and with no super effective moves. Uh, Bugs and Wheelia are going to be useful because of their resistances. But besides that, this will be Draco Breach reporting out. God bless and safe travels.